And uh, today I will be showing you another video that I think it's very uh, interesting and valuable as well because I got some comments from a previous video that I you can see the link below that I posted about a month ago on how to um, fly from LAX to Paris uh, using airline miles and the cost was like five dollars sixty cents per person and a lot of um, a lot of my friends uh, told me that uh, they're interested in these kind of stuff and uh, and uh, yeah that's where my passion is I would love to share with you more about these techniques or tricks on how to use airline miles or credit card points to fly for free pretty much so today um, I will be talking about a another flight I think it's a bargain deal um, for those of you who know about airline and I mean you probably heard about Japan Airline which is one of the top rated airlines in the world I mean the service is top-notch the cabins the staff is all all great um, and you know that you can fly Japan Airline from the United States to Tokyo using uh, American Airline miles of 60,000 American Airline miles one way each way so 120,000 American Airline miles round trip per person from United States to Tokyo Japan Narita International Airport uh, which is a great deal I think in the last video uh, well the trip that I talked about from LAX to Paris was also using American Airline miles and I shared with you some links for um, you know a few credit cards that offered a, a generous sign up bonus uh, to earn uh, American Airline miles um, so once you have those miles um, and the, it's, I think American Airline miles are relatively easy to accrue uh, considering there are so many credit card programs out there um, or you can just you know once you have the credit card get the sign up bonus and if you continue to use that credit card um, you know spending on gas you know grocery I mean you easily earn thousands of miles every month and they add up very quickly so at the end of the day you get a lot of American airline miles um, relatively easily I would say and if you don't have enough um, American airline miles you there uh, there are transfer partners with uh, Marriott so if you have Marriott I will have another video talking about Marriott points so Marriott if you have a Marriott account and you have some Marriott you've stayed with uh, you know in Marriott hotels um, you earn Marriott points which is also very very valuable they can be transferred to American Airlines if they're like if you're short a few thousand or uh, you know some miles uh, it's you know you can transfer from your own Marriott account um, now it's they're called Bonvoy right your Bonvoy account um, to make up the difference um, in order to have enough miles to you know complete the booking um, okay so I will um, walk you through so a little bit tricky unlike unlike the last video we were you know we were able to find everything online on under the American AA website, right? American Airline website. Um, so, to book a Japan Airline flight from United States to Tokyo, you will have to call. You have to call. You have to have, can only be done over the phone. But and also um, the problem is you do you're not able to find you're not able to search the availability through American Airline website. But however, I will show you how to find availability and how to make the booking okay okay here we go I'm gonna show you step by step how we do this <laughs> so we're talking about flying from the United States to Japan um, Tokyo Narita Airport using American Airlines miles but the problem is like I said you're not able to find um, this flight you know the availability through American Airlines website um, but you can book with American Airlines miles you can you just simply cannot find under their website so there's a, a trick or technique that um, I'm gonna share with you right now uh, to find availability uh, so one thing is um, so we're using British Airway website we're using the British Airway search engine 
the reason being is that British Airways and American Airlines are partner airlines. They're partners, right? They're called One World. Um, so a lot of well, batteries running low. So a lot of American Airlines flights or their partner flights uh, can be found on British Airways website. Um, so also the Japan Airlines is also part of the One World Partnership. That's why we can find Japan Airlines uh, space on the British Airways website. And there's a space that we can call American Airlines to complete the booking. Okay, so we we search for availability um, on British Airway website and then call American Airlines to book. Right. So here's the thing. So you log on to log into your British Airway account. If you don't have one, just um, make one sign up one for free. Um, so here's the thing. If you just search right here, it's going to show you. That's general. That's a revenue ticket, right? We we're, we're not interested about uh, the regular ticket, right? Uh, we're talking. We're interested in using the airline miles. They call it award ticket, and the program with British Airways is called a uh, Avios or Avios, whatever you call it. So it's called Avios. Um, that's their name of their program. All right, how do I search this? So I think it's it just scroll. You have to scroll down. Oh, here is here it is. So it's called Avios program. So you should have to click this book flights with Avios. That's how you search for award space. All right. Let's say we fly from Boston. Right, so it's a city where I used to live. Uh, there are several cities that can go to Japan. I think Chicago. Uh, San Diego being one Boston so Boston will be the best value because on the East Coast that's the longest flight you, you will normally get uh, I don't know how much it's gonna cost for a regular ticket business class ticket from Boston to Tokyo I, I would assume it's in well, at least two or three thousand uh, dollars if not more um, so Narita Japan let's search we search one way i like i always like to search one way at a time i don't i don't do round trips because it's just uh i rather do two one-way search rather than a round trip search just to make things easier um i did a previous search and i found there's availability on february the 18th but you can do more search side but there, i'm pretty sure there are availability in january as well so this because this route like boston to Tokyo is not a very popular route um, a lot of people don't fly this route and the same thing with San Diego to Tokyo I always find a, a plenty of space uh, flying from San Diego San Diego to Tokyo just it's just a smaller area yeah sorry about the cutoff of the battery uh, the laptop ran out of battery so now it's all plugged and ready to go. So that's the screen we left off with. I think we were searching from Boston to Tokyo. And uh, I did a quick search for uh, February. Um, you know, we're searching economy, business class, right? We're searching about business class. I think business class is best value uh, in this case. Uh, even though it uses more miles, but usually the tax and fees are the same as the uh, economy class. So in that case, I think it's it's a no-brainer going business if you if you have enough miles. So uh, right, check this out. February 18th, there is available. Um, so this is the, the flight we're talking about. It's just just flight. I always prefer non-stop, especially for these long haul flights so they're meaning there's no connection anywhere from boston to narita uh, 14 hours think about with all those nice food and comfortable cabin lay flat you know seats right you can pretty much sleep on it um all the nice staff uh, it will be a great experience for that 14 hour you know it's it's definitely worth uh it's definitely worth it so there are five business class available 
All right, so we're not booking with British Airways though. We're only, like I said, we're only using this website to check availability. Now we know there are five business class uh, seats available, meaning we should be able to book with the American airline miles for one of those five seats. So now I need to do is to pick up the phone and call, right? Um, let's do a quick Google search. So which number do we call? We just call this number, account service. A, a advantage is the program name for American Airlines, just like Avios is for British Airways. So that's their direct number. Um, just call that number, tell them, you know, you already found a seat February 18th or whatever date you found available. Tell them there should be a seat and ask the agent to look it up and book it for you. Uh, it should cost about 60,000 um, American Airlines miles for business class one way or 30,000 uh, miles for an economy class, if I remember that correctly. And the tax and fees are about $100 for each way. So about $200, a little over, maybe $200 for a round trip. So that's a great, great value. So let's see for that same flight, if we buy regular ticket, right? How much is that gonna cost? Like from, I mean, just out of curiosity, from Boston to Tokyo, see how much it would cost normally um for that same flight right for that same flight uh let's see one adult a uh, one way we picked uh february the 18th uh but we're searching for business class so we'll see what would the price be um in a second it's going to show us how much it would cost if you pay that with cash uh non-stop right it's a non-stop flight so japan airlines wow is that the same flight it's probably the same flight i mean there's only one flight as far as i know yep yeah, 12 20 landing 4 20 exact same flight that would cost $5,482 one way. And you can get the same flight for 60,000 American airline miles plus about $100, a little over $100 uh, in tax and fees. So, wow, that's a great deal. Um, for those of you who uh, didn't, re didn't see my last video, um, I shared with you links to apply for um, American Airlines uh, credit cards that gives you sign up bonus or you can do a quick Google search um, should bring you to this, that um, page as well there are a few cards there be oh so here we go that's the page I'm talking about I'm gonna post the link below uh, so there are five four products that offer you know, ranges from 10,000 to 70,000 American airline miles. Um, if you apply all of them that you're, you know, way qualified, you're, you have way enough points to redeem for a round trip, maybe even for two people, uh, you can bring your spouse or your girlfriend with you. That would be a, a fantastic experience. Uh, even, even the economy class, I, cause I remember back in 2000, was that 15? I flew there in business class, but I flew back in economy class. So I just sort of want to experience, you know, both cabins in Japan Airlines. And um, yeah, they, they, they were they were equally good. Um, I would say, of course, business class offers you more amenities um, like free drinks and free food. But, you know, economy class is also top notch as as compared to, you know, other economy classes offered by other airlines um so japan airline definitely is you know worth the title it's uh it offers great amenity great service and uh you will not regret taking uh this flight for sure okay so if you like the content you know smash the like button below 
subscribe leave any comments let me know if you like this or not uh, and uh, i'm hoping to uh, post more uh, or share with you more uh, information like this in the future okay i'll see you in the next one